Yep. And uh, I was talking to Quan off screen uh, stage because, you know, I, I haven't looked at the bracket really. I, I played my matches. I kind of walked around and socialized for a bit and then came back to this. So, but Monty beat someone pretty good to get here. Let me see if I can pull that up. Yeah, I don't have the bracket either, so that'll be great. Um, yeah, so he beat Debo to get here and Muffin from Mars. Those were two O's. And uh, Arkistar as well. Um, so he's had a, quite a run so far. Uh, and Spargo, obviously just an amazing player, one of the best probably in the world. And uh, he plays Game & Watch? Oh, this is backwards. I was like, the Pyramithra makes a little bit more sense. I, I know him for his cloud, but this makes sense to me. Yeah, absolutely. I was just going to yeah. comment. Uh, I was very much expecting to see the, uh, the cloud, but maybe that's more of his... Uh, you know, his online forte, but uh, yeah. a very strong pick still as well, Pyramithra. Yeah, the, the tags on the screen are backwards right now. Spargo is Pyramithra, and Monty is the Game & Watch. Uh, I do know that Monty plays Game & Watch players, uh, so. Pretty even game so far. Down tilt to up air with Pyra's, very damaging, and uh, sends him really far back, too. Yeah, uh, Spargo doing an Ooh, excellent job. It. Racking up that damage, closing up that first stock on a uh, on uh, Monty, uh, Spargo only taking about 56%, but Monte is definitely getting that string. Uh, very safe option going for that uh, that up special. Yeah. You know, that get out, uh, get out of jail free card is definitely going to be something that's going to be very useful against uh, Pyro. Oh. Bit of momentum here for Monty, setting up a ledge trap. Edge guard? Oh, oh no. I think he's he took his jump, his actually. Yeah. yeah, but even then, they, yeah. uh, the recovery on uh, Pyra is a little, a little weak. Yeah, it can be for sure. Uh all right, back on the stage. Monty taking a little bit of damage, but I mean, even stock game down air into up smash. That's a true combo for Pyra and uh, didn't quite kill. Game & Watch is light, but not quite that light. Like, yeah, absolutely. Spargo's definitely got the- Oh, oh my, my god. god. Yeah, Ryan's right about to say Spargo has to be a little bit careful for this, uh, for the weight class that, uh, that Pyra is, but Monte retaliating back very quickly, closing out that stock. Spargo now uh, in the lead, uh, you know, only about 50% and rising, but definitely has that one stock lead. Yeah. Okay, we get the back air. Keep, uh, Monty keeping Spargo off stage here, but he's able to make it back to the stage. Yeah, you, you can see him throwing him off stage quite frequently, going for that back air. That's definitely something that he's going to want to do is to try to definitely cheese uh, Spargo and kind of abuse, wow. you know, that lack of recovery. Wow. Okay, Spargo. Got so much oh mileage gosh. out of this one up B punish. I was going to say, Spargo doing a really good job of punishing those up Bs from Game & Watch. He got like four or five up airs on him just purely off of that. That's a second kind of hard read Monty's been going for, just trying to call out uh, the landing oh. with that. Uh, oh, down smash did smash. not burrow there. Okay, up air into the up B, connecting for a little bit of damage, setting yep. up for a ledge trap. Spargo at a whopping 156. Okay. Monte yeah. definitely needs to close out the stock. Monte's very gonna soon. die to literally anything right oh, now. Oh yeah. And it's gonna be the read into the up smash. Yeah, that's a very Roll strong read. call out yeah. option. Yeah. That multi hit is definitely devastating. Not yeah. only can it like it scoop you up like that, but that's just yeah. a lot, a lot of damage. Because uh, he rolled it. in right, and it literally sucked him up into yeah. the um, finishing hit. So. Really good game one from Spargo there, and also from Monty, he couldn't quite um, keep up at the end there, but to be fair, it was just like, Game & Watch is really light, so he was losing some, the first stock he lost like pretty early, but you know, he was able to keep it toe-to-toe -to -toe in terms of momentum, but. Yeah, absolutely, and I'm, not, I'm actually not even sure who's uh, favor that it's in matchup-wise. Both of those are very strong contenders, and I feel like, yeah. I feel like for the weight class that, you know, Pyra is, uh, Game Watch can absolutely abuse that. Totally. Uh, Pyra and Mithras are like still pretty new characters. Literally the new ca newest characters we have. I'm not even sure where she lines up in terms of uh, heaviness in the game. Like, she one of the heavier characters, one of the lighter characters. Um, she seems to me to be like maybe a midweight, but yeah, definitely. Not but sure. that, that that speed though is definitely one thing that Spargo oh, definitely yeah. has. Uh, on Monte, as we see that, yeah. wow, fantastic 41% opening combo. Yeah, and as you were saying, uh, Mithra, a very speedy character, so, you know, the, the stats change as well. Pyra might be a little bit heavier. Okay, Monte, again, 
doing what Gaming Watch does, just getting these grabs, throwing oh my goodness. Spargo off stage. Calling out that uh, that high uh, up special with the up air. Yeah. Oh, is that oh, going to be wow. it? No, not quite yet. Yeah, yeah that that is a, a, a super intense uh, disjoint. Those falling up airs from uh, Pyra will absolutely destroy uh, a character as light as Game of Watch. Yeah. Okay. Another question. I mean, good ledge trap again there. He just faded back into the F tilt, able to secure the stock, but he's got a lot of damage on himself. Um, Game Watch should be able to close out the stock here, too. That's if he even can find the opening, because Spargo's not quite letting him have it. Yeah, and this is like one of the big benefits of playing a character like um, Pyra and Mithra, that you can switch between them. Wow, that was some sick movement. Yeah, that was a crazy movement option. <laughs> Spargo really showing off some stuff. Right I had, I've never seen that, actually. <laughs> yeah, that was the first that, time I'd ever yeah. saw that. That covered a lot of ground. Yeah. Uh, and I know in the most recent patch, actually, that move specifically uh, was nerfed. Oh, where, where, really? Where, yeah, where before, it didn't matter actually what weight class you were, it would always send with the same exact knockback. So it just kills everyone. Yeah, so <laughs> now... It's, it's strong. I mean, it's it still, was strong. Don't yeah. get me wrong. It's still an incredibly strong yeah. option, but just not quite oh. as uh, busted. Ooh, that, is. though, however, is definitely going to be one of Game Watch's easier kill options. Yeah. Monty here hanging on to his second stock, still barely, though, at 130% now. Two stocks speak. Two stocks apiece and Spargo on a fresh one. Semi-fresh now. And Monty got a little bit of uh, some momentum. Oh, yeah, you can see Spargo's definitely trying to shake this man up by <laughs> switching back and forth in an instant. Oh, oh there it is again. Yeah, he B reverse. Oh. I think that's what it was, right? But he just did it grounded the first time? Yeah, he, uh, he also didn't charge it quite enough. But yeah. that'll close out that stock right again. And here we see uh, in the second game, same position. Spargo on the 50 67%. Uh, two, one stock up over Monte, and we are seeing this uh, quick volley get it up to 24%. Uh, opting to go for a bit safer option, though, and kind of sacrificing that uh, ledge guard. Okay. Spargo kind of just spacing out, trying to find uh, his way back to the stage. Monte no, not letting that happen. Grab here. Back to the throw again, sets up the ledge trap with the bacon, just kind of limiting Spargo's options back to the stage. Yeah, one of the things I'm definitely waiting for that uh, I've seen <laughs> I've seen that uh, one of the past MSMs, I think probably about two weeks ago, Monte will go the entire set without using judgment and he will throw it out like a wild card. Oh, God, and he right, will just dude. like absolutely just like destroy someone last stock. Now that you mention it, he might be one of the most conservative nine like game and watch players in that oh, regard. Fantastic <laughs> spike off stage. Yeah. Noticing uh Spargo went a little bit too far off stage and taking uh, full advantage of that situation. Oh. Wow, again. Yeah. You think that's a down tilt to an IDJ uh, up air? I'm not sure if that true comboed in that situation. Like, you, you, didn't, you know? Uh, that, that definitely, at, at that higher percent, I definitely.